Hi guys, welcome back like, to my channel. Comment and subscribe. Welcome, 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 welcome to First Time Mom 76 Budget. We're here to um, have lots of fun, budget, pay off our debt, unbox, just have a lot of fun. So if that sounds like something that you would like, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and enjoy the video. We are doing um, our savings challenges for the uh, first paycheck of May. And so the first challenge we always do is the zero hour challenge. And this zero hour challenge is every Friday, you take um, the balance of your uh, checking account and you zero it out like the last three digits to make it zero 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 point zero zero which is a very easy challenge it's you know electronic all you have to do is shift the money over and so if you see in the first quarter we had seventy nine dollars and thirty two cents which was awesome so for five seven may seventh it was six 56 and then in May 14th it was 265 I actually uh I don't know why I ended up with pretty good numbers all the time but it's just the way God made it And I'm putting this money into uh, savings right now. But, it, and yeah, I don't know what I may do with it. I may put it in, like, my, um, it'll still be savings, but I might put it in my uh, IRA account. I don't know. I don't know. I'm just going off to my brain. But right now, it's going into savings account. Okay, so, actually, for that, for that, last two pay periods 656 plus 265 $9.21 that was almost $10 saved alright alright the kitty challenge is always the last challenge we're gonna move over to and y'all see I got a new um, a new whatever you call this thing mat together we make a family Family is the heart of our home. A family is a patchwork of the guys. We family here in this community, in this budgeting community. You get so much support and so much love, and it. I am very grateful, very grateful. So I didn't tell you that budgeted for um, <clears throat> budgeted for. Savings challenges, I budgeted $180. Okay. But the zero out challenge does not come out of my budget, the $180 budget. It comes from my paycheck buffer. I always have, leave a buffer. And that's what this one comes out. So this is the 26 paycheck bingo challenge. This is just something I made up. I didn't make a bingo, but you know, I put the numbers in for 26 paychecks. And uh, whatever number I get on is the number I got to save. And this little thing here, this one in there. So we need to get that other. This little bingo thing comes from the Dollar Tree. I love the Dollar Tree. Uh-oh, there's one in there. So let's see what it is. This is 75. I don't even know if you guys will be able to see that. Is 75 <laughs> man these hundreds are killing me they killing me they killing me so 75 it's going to be a hundred dollars going into this challenge that 
It's okay. Might as well go ahead and get that over with. So 75. Boop. And let's count out 100. Oh, we didn't ever count out uh, the $180. 20, 40, 60, 80, 1, 20, 40, 60, 70, 80, 180 dollars. And that other money is for something else, for my cash stuffing and sinking funds. Okay, so we got 75, which is 100 dollars, 20, 40, 60, 81. That's 100 dollars. And that hundred dollars is going into the twenty-six paycheck challenge. And so, at the end of this challenge, you will have two thousand dollars. My challenges are, are, you know, pretty small. I think anybody may be able to do them because they're not huge. And not like ten thousand dollars, you know. Maybe one day I get to where I can do the ten thousand dollar challenges and stuff like that. But as of right now, we sticking with that one. About two that. Okay. So this is another challenge that I came up with is keep the change. I always have to tell everybody these little hands and savings jars are not mine. I just got it off the internet. So guys, this pay period, my thing was $15, $15. That was the end, the last. So with this one, you take the last two whole dollar amounts of your paycheck and you save it. So this pay period, it was $15. Or was it 16? It was either 15 or... It was... No, it was $15.96. So, $15. But... I ain't about that life. So, we gonna at least put... A $20 bill in there. We going with 20 So, we gonna put $20 in there. And all of this uh, money in this... For this savings challenge goes to paying off my debt and uh, I'm not keeping the money in there for the entire year I actually go ahead I'm do every monthly I'm gonna go ahead and um, take that money out and put it towards debt thanks to sons and roses for that idea so to keep the change we'll get $20. Oop. There you go. $20. Oh, you know what? So the next challenge that we're going to do is another one that I came up with for the month of May, but I think I'm going to continue doing this all year. And this one is... I ain't got nothing wrong. This is like the healthy living tracker, but it is, um, so if whatever pounds I lose, I put $5 and I'm only doing my daily exercise for every day that I do the exercise, I add a dollar. Okay. I'm not doing these, even though I'm tracking, but I'm only putting a dollar and this money is going to go just for me, for my personal use. So it's an incentive to actually do better <laughs> with my health because then I get to buy something. But, man, I did not do very well. I did not. Breakfast, I did awesome. Lunch, I didn't do that good. Look, it was like nurses week or something. We had a, they brought us lunch every day of the week. Okay, and then I, I can't blame nobody but myself for the lousy dinners, okay? I did not do well at all. My hydration, I kind of, I did pretty good. Did pretty good. I think my biggest things are the weekends. Like when I'm at home, 
for some reason I don't drink I'm more drinking like see coffee and juice and not really juice I drink like the Gatorade Zeros and I do drink Coke Zero and I do drink some water I just don't make the goal of my six cups but just got to do better this is showing me what I'm doing and what I'm going to do I think I'm going to add a notes page or something so I can actually write things down of what what's going on so guys I started at 197.8 the first week I was at 197 how about for week two all them lunches <laughs> and poor dinner choices 198.7 I am so angry at myself well not angry but you know so what that's because of that because this is just something I added because I gained was that almost almost two pounds So, for gaining, guess what I'm going to do? It's going to be $10 a pound. So, that's going to be $20 out of my savings challenge. Just wait, that's not going in there. It's going to go to my debt payment. Yay! We're going to, oops. How did that come out of there? We're going to add $20 to that. Because I almost gained two pounds. So they go a 20 added to my debt. Okay. But so I did almost lose a pound. So I will give myself five dollars for that. And then for this, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, I did five uh so let me just give myself the 10. Well, why does it matter? I don't know. Two fives. So I will give myself ten dollars for because I'm I only do this challenges every payday. So I gave myself five dollars for losing, I guess, eight ounces or something. <laughs> but that's not even close to a pound. But it'll be it's really five dollars per pound. And then a dollar for um each daily exercise that goal that I meet so that's ten dollars but since I gain I'm going to make myself ten dollars a pound anytime I I gain weight then it's gonna be ten dollars a pound it's gonna to have to go to to debt okay so I want to write that in there so I don't forget so I don't forget so we're gonna do five for one pound loss I need a red pen so I can write this in here Lord this video is going to be longer than I wanted it to be because I'm rambling Where's my red pen And I just had a red pen, but okay, that's all right. We'll just write with this one. Oh no, let me go ahead and put um, one dollar for every exercise goal, and then. It's like I'm punishing myself. Ten dollars for one pound gain. Okay, so we're gonna go to the back. And uh, write down for week one. We're just going to put week one 
in to five dollars for uh for almost a pound loss and five dollars for five days and exercise go and then ten dollars to debt for almost two pound gain all right let's see i can keep track of it y'all see that so for week one and two, I gave myself $5 for almost a pound loss, $5 for a five-day exercise go met, and $10 to debt for almost two pound gain. Lord Jesus. Okay, so that is that challenge. That is awesome. Guys, if you have not downloaded this, go ahead to my Etsy shop and download it. It's 50 cents for the month of May. Go ahead and get it. This is something you can use all year long you can challenge yourself you can make the numbers you can put five dollars for every goal made or whatever and when you reach whatever goal you want to make you know buy yourself some new clothes because you lost a lot of weight or whatever you want to do okay okay so uh we gotta move on to the last challenge and the and you guys, I did make an envelope for that, uh, that, uh, whatever you call that, the exercise goal thing, but I didn't bring it in here. So, that healthy living tracker. So, right now we got, we got $30 left for this kitty challenge. And if we all know, the Kitty Challenge is going towards my vacation in July. So hopefully we can knock this out by July. So let's see. 11 plus 12. So we only got $7 left to make 30. We gonna figure this out. Oh, this is what we gonna do right here. The fourteen, the fourteen and the sixteen. That's gonna give us thirty. Thirty dollars, boom. The fourteen and sixteen. So far for the first quarter, we had $273. All right. All right, all right. So that concludes my savings challenges. I put a hundred and eighty dollars. Well, no, I didn't put a hundred. Well, you can say a hundred and eighty dollars, but a hundred and sixty really went into the the challenges, and then twenty dollars went to debt because I didn't do what I needed to do. Kitty challenge. All right, guys. And that is it for my challenges. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Have a blessed, blessed, blessed day. And I'll see you in the next one.